Time freezes for 48 hours and you're the only thing not affected. What do you choose to do? RTX 3090. Here I come. Spend the whole 48 hours just trying to find one somewhere. It's okay. I live pretty close to Lennis Tech Tips. I'm sure he has quite a few laying around. Get his Risen 5000 series chips too. Try to infiltrate Area 51. Now, they're the ones causing this. You think you're a step ahead, but you're actually four behind. I wish I could freeze for 48 hours and time would just move on. That's called heroin. Made my day. Tales from the Loop did an episode similar to this. Except it spanned months. I assumed. They ransacked stores and fancy homes, caught a parent cheating, and lost hope of the situation as a whole. Depressing series and hard to watch. Believe it or not. Compared to a similar counterpart, like Black Mirror. Simonson Hag is an artist and the series was based on the art book of the same name. The original Twilight Zone series did this back in the black and white days. A guy had a stopwatch that he could use to stop time and do things. Did all the obvious stuff with it. But then the watch broke, and he was stuck with time frozen forever. Twilight Zone was the original Minf Peep TV. Get beaten up by a 4D time cop. Time police moth of peeper. Stop. Breaking. The. Space. Time. Continuum. I will mess with time. Sniffle. Put sunglasses on everyone I can find. Then when time freezes everyone suddenly wonders WTF just happened. No no no. Put buckets on everyone's heads far more confusing. Rubber ducks. Crime. Procrastinate. Probs. Haha. <laughs> Most realistic answer. It would be like having two hours before bedtime to watch a movie and spending most of the two hours adding movies to your watch list. About a half hour of not realizing. 47. Five hours of existential crisis. Followed by years of therapy. I would be a bank robbing mofo. I could amass one hell of a stack in 48 hours. Just get to Vegas and pickpocket all the high roller tables in pits. Tie people's shoelaces together. Pick up all of the dog crap in my neighbor's yard and put it in her living room. And steal the Declaration of Independence. Then hide it in Nick Cage's house. Steal money from banks and replace it with chocolate coins. Ask the Japanese. They made a whole genre of peep asking this question. Probably browse Reddit and wonder why there's nothing new. Isn't that just normal in Reddit? Rob drug dealers. What are they gonna do? Report it to the police. I'd steal so much. I wouldn't steal a lot. Just something people assumed was too well guarded to be stolen. And carefully leave a calling card. World's greatest thief, with basically zero effort. I'd steal a bicycle, because I don't own one, and ride around enjoying the quiet and stillness. Maybe an electric bicycle, because I'm old and fat, and in reality I'd probably last 10 minutes on a regular bike. Finally get a good night's sleep without any interruptions. Be confused. I would jump from one idea to another, and won't be able to start until the time's over. So basically nothing. Have you ever seen Click with Adam Sandler? Yeah. It's only 1 hour and 47 minutes. What do I do with the other 46 hours? Watch it again. Steal all the peeping Legos I want. Find every winning scratch off lottery ticket. Walk around naked with no shame. Do a helicopter every now and then. Find a nice beauty spot. Drink some beers. Whilst having some music on. A basic way to spend my 48 hours. But a peaceful one. Probably catch up on schoolwork and sleep the rest of the time. Drink some sleepy time tea and enjoy some good sleep on the other hand. 
I used to fantasize about having a large wad of cash so maybe I'll first go out and go do some grocery shopping. Master but on top of a skyscraper. Homelander. Is that you? I can do whatever I want. Watch a TV series without my housemate walking into the lounge and asking questions. Colon. I don't have big goals haha. Have some fun. Change things ever so slightly like switching people's clothes. Turning them around. Turning cars around. Put a dog lease hand random people's hands. One time one phrases. So many minds are going to be blown. The answers here are a lot more PG than I was expecting. Find my dad. Have you looked in the last place you saw him? In his mother? I don't know if he would wanna check. Have a massive panic attack cause WTF is going on. Personally I know I still would not clean my room and that thought scares me. If time freezes. How can it be for 48 hours? As I say with every time stop post, prevent a boy Frenchman from walking up some stairs in Egypt. I will walk on street, and when I find someone using his phone I will take his phone from his hand and open Rick Roll on it then put it back in his hand, and keep doing that for everyone I see for the rest of the 48 hours. Probably count the ballots in Nevada. It's taking so long. That's why it's named Nevada. Mother. Of. God. They are still only 76% done. For peeps sake. I'd rob every bank I could find. That's a given. Rob every drug dealer only for cash and pot. It's not like they're going to report it. Then steal all the toys. And while I'm at it, maybe pour a bit of fox scent in my ex-wife's defrosters. Something something find a way to be rich blah blah. Pull everyone's pants down. I'd go shopping. I would hit all the big corporate stores and just steal everything of use. I'd finish my Christmas shopping. I'd steal a fridge and a few freezers and stock my garage with food for a year. I'd steal items that are going to be rare fast this Christmas and then wrestle them on eBay once time unfroze. I would hit the dispensaries and steal all of the weed. I'd take cash from all corporate stores. I would be set up for a long time. I might also make it look like my best friend's abusive ex had peed peeing on him. Rob a grocery store. Or a bank IDK. Aside from the very, very, very illegal things I will not mention publicly, I would go to the Sneeland. There's an Amazon warehouse about 5 miles away. This kid's going shopping. Might be unethical. But I'm taking a PS5 and tons of games my broke self can't afford. I'd get myself a few games for my Switch and maybe get a new TV IDK. My husband would watch Peepography for 47 hours. What about the last hour? Probably eat had D's. Hard D's. People saying bank robbing. Now this implies the risk of getting caught. Just take money out of people's wallets, and put the wallets back. Steal some stuff from the people, who just got out of the store and steal the receipt. Punch a man in the balls to see, if the pain will come after time resumes. This might be kind of weird, but I steal all the really good toys from Walmart, that are on the hot lists right now. Not single one, but quite a few. Walmart can take the hit. Then I donate all that speep to toys for tots. So many politicians and CEOs would just disappear. And I suppose you have nothing to do with this, HMM. I would think about doing illegal things, but then I would wonder if people were just not able to move but could still see what I'm doing, so I would be too scared to do anything. Just completely erase any and all evidence that Jimmy Neutron ever existed and watch the world burn over trying to figure out this Mandela effect. Scroll Reddit. Steal everything. Sleep. Chill. 48 hours without having to do anything would be great. Secondary question. Would it be possible to cause an erection on someone stuck in the time freeze? Asking for myself. 
Probably steal $1 from everyone who I could. $20 from every cash register. More from banks. Panic. Throw a bunch of knives at an overly buff 17 year old. Go find Madonna.